So after this orientation, we'll work through four units together. As you saw on the framework, these units map on to the four recommendations in the practice guide. Each unit will be structured relatively the same way, so you can expect certain activities that will help you dig into those practices that are recommended by the guide. At the beginning of each unit, you'll start by reading the section of the practice guide that describes the recommendations discussed in that unit. After that, you'll try out some of the content yourselves through some interactive activities that we've designed for you. And then you'll have a chance to see some of the recommendations in action in real classrooms, and you will discuss what you notice and some insights you gain from watching those classroom videos. Together, we'll address important issues around each recommendation. First, we'll introduce some research and have uh, some discussion about important points related to that issue. And then we'll turn the discussion over to you all so you can share your own experiences, opinions, and thoughts about that issue. Um, we always want to hear from our expert panel to learn a little bit more about what went into the, to the recommendation and how those experts see the recommendation being put into practice in classrooms. And every unit will feature an opportunity for you to demonstrate your own learning, to show what you're taking away from the unit and how you're applying that knowledge to students and to classroom practice. Mm -hmm. We also feature opportunities to dig deeper into the content. We have lots of resources that you can use in your classroom, videos and additional readings if you want to learn more about any of the recommendations. So now that you've had a chance to get to know us a little bit and to understand more about the structure of this course, we invite you to um, finish up the orientation unit by introducing yourself so that we can get to know you. And if you wouldn't mind, we'd love for you to share some of your own personal goals for why you've chosen to join this MOOC ed. Um, We'd also invite you to watch um, some short classroom videos that we've placed here in this unit. And we want you to discuss some of the similarities and differences that you notice between these teaching practices and the teaching practices that you're using in your own classroom. And finally, um, we invite you to meet the expert panel and they're gonna provide a few introductory remarks around the practice guide. So now, without further ado, let's get started.